Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a spider can. Oh, hey, hey, how you doing? <laughs> Didn't know you were there. Welcome back to another Corbin Connection reaction. And if you're new, I do more than just reactions. Uh, everything that I do is comedy based set up to make you laugh so check out the channel check out my cha channel trailer uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button yeah um, this is called honest trailers I forgot it's called honest trailers and what they do is they take out different things that happen in movie trailers and kind of make fun of them uh, they're pretty good at it too. At the end, they actually take comments from people who comment on the video and you type whatever you want and the guy will actually say whatever you want in his professional newscaster type voice. It's hilarious. Yes, I would like some eggs. Could you pass me the tape, please? I mean, it's just, it's hilarious. Like, yeah. So after this, check out their channel, uh, show them some love, hit that subscribe button to them, hit the subscribe button for me, and yeah, without further ado, let's check it out. Or I'm looking over here, you looking over there. So let's check it out. Careful viewer, my spoiler sense is tingling. Since 2002, we've had six movies, two reboots, and three Spider-Man. Now, just when audiences might be getting a little sick of the franchise, Marvel swoops in to deliver a crowd-pleasing comedy that's gonna keep Spider-Man in theaters until the f***ing sun burns out of the sky. Spider-Man Homecoming. It's pretty good, though. Tobey Maguire couldn't keep it up. Andrew Garfield couldn't get it started. But Tom Holland hits the ground swinging in a great reboot that just assumes you're all caught up on the MCU. Pretty sure this guy's a war criminal. Sure now, favorite bro. Spider Complete with a glossed over origin story. Put it in the comments. An actor comments who doesn't have below. premature old face. And a villain who doesn't already have some forced personal connection to Peter Parker. Unless his dad. Alright, two out of three ain't bad. Witness a brand new take on Spider Man. He's a millennial now who can't stay off his phone. What is the current standard unit? I take this real quick. I'll only be a sec. Fine. Constantly vlogs, watches himself on YouTube, and has zero patience for anything. Hey, how long have we been here anyways? 37 minutes. What? He's got all of the usual spider skills, plus a powerful new one. Never facing consequences for his actions, whether he's getting away with ditching detention. Hey, where you going? Get back here. Quitting on his team. You can't just quit on us, stroll up, and be welcome back. Hey, welcome back, Peter. Falsely imprisoning people. You shouldn't steal cars, it's bad. It's my car, dumbass. Wrecking a car, wrecking a store, huh. wrecking a ferry, or wrecking his girlfriend's entire life. Whatever's going on with you, I hope you figure it out. You can be sure this web slinger will get off with no more than a stern talking to. You're a good kid, and you're a smart kid, so just try to keep your head straight, okay? Okay. All right, get out of here. Well, the older I get, the more I relate to J. Jonah Jameson. He's a menace to the entire city! I want that wall-crawling arachnid prosecuted! You've seen him as Batman and Birdman. Now, prepare for Michael Keaton's third-winged creature role as the Vulture. He's a blue-collar guy who gets shafted by Stark Industries. <laughs> and instead of filing a lawsuit against a billionaire clearly in the wrong, he'll build a giant bird mech jetpack? <laughs> uh. You'll be bored stiff when Vulture fights Spider-Man in bland CGI slugfests, but genuinely scared when he's just being Michael Keaton. Were you scared? I bet you were glad when your old pal Spider-Man showed up in the elevator, though. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, Uncle Ben and Richard Parker. There's a new absentee dad in town, Tony Stark. Iron Man is back as the drunk rich stepfather you'd expect him to be, who will build you a killer robot suit. Activating instant kill. Send you into battle at 15, then literally phone in his parenting until you screw up enough to get his attention. Okay, it's not working out. I'm gonna need a suit back. Really, Tony? 
you just fought your best friend over keeping tabs on superheroes, and you just let your pet superhero run amok. Is anyone paying attention to the timeline anymore? This is approaching X-Men levels of sloppy. So she sends Bishop back in time. No, just his consciousness into his younger self. Wow. So enjoy another Super Smash hit whose success was far from guaranteed, with two competing studios fighting for control, six different screenwriters, and a director with just two low-budget indies to his name. Dang, it's like Sony finally cracked the code on how to make the Spider-Verse happen. Let Marvel do the work. Let Starring Marvel do all of Tom them. Netherlands, Drunkle Stark, Only Winners Do Drugs, Chef, the disembodied voice of Jennifer Connelly. You can call me Karen if you would like. Marissa Tomei, Vulture, or the unexpected virtue of casting Michael Keaton. Technically in the movie, Tony Ravioli, Mary Pixie Jane Girl. Hey there, Martin Star now. Not not your Asian sidekick. And Wonder Woman? The perks of being a wall crawler. Bold move putting a set piece in an elevator shaft. Spider-Man can't catch a break with that. I like bread. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Darkness falls across the land. The midnight hour is close at hand. I'm David Pumpkins. Any questions? Halloween, the night he came home. Cool stuff, cool stuff. Um, yeah, I've seen uh, Spider-Man Homecoming. It was actually pretty good to me. I, I liked it. They didn't really reboot it, but they kind of had to a little bit. Yeah, he's going to be in um, Infinity War. Everybody is in Infinity War. Um, one thing about me is I love superheroes. Marvel and DC. I'm a fan of both. Um, yeah. So I'm definitely waiting for Infinity War to come out. But yeah, go over to their channel, check them out. And um, I think that's it. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed this reaction. Uh, hit that like button for me. Hit that subscribe button for me. And until next time, deuces, cabooses. Talk to you later.